the town of Brookline, one in 10 people have asthma, and that number is even higher for young people. Car exhaust is especially harmful to people who have asthma because it causes their symptoms to flare up. It's a hard thing not being able to breathe. And if you don't idle your car, that could prevent someone from having to feel that way. Everybody knows that diesel and car exhaust is bad for people. It's down here on the ground where we breathe it every day. It contributes to asthma, lung cancer, even heart attacks. It's especially bad for pregnant women, babies, kids, and the elderly. And you probably know that exhaust is bad for the environment. Greenhouse gases cause global warming. More than half of air pollution is from car and truck exhaust. Acid rain kills fish, damages plants, and pollutes the food we eat. But did you know that letting your car idle is bad for your wallet, bad for your car, and bad for you? Idling for just 10 seconds uses more gas than stopping and starting your car. Car engines warm up twice as fast when driving, and idling increases engine wear. Even with the windows rolled up, some exhaust still leaks into the car, and you breathe it in. So you see, you're really doing yourself a favor when you turn the engine off. You save money on gas, your car runs better and lasts longer, and you stay healthy. Plus, it's good for the environment, which affects us all. It's kind of a no-brainer. And it's against the law. Both the state of Massachusetts and the town of Brookline have laws prohibiting the idling of motor vehicles for longer than five minutes. Safe travels.